Hi guys! Um, welcome to my first hair tutorial here in my bathroom in our new house. Potentially our last depending on how this goes in terms of videoing in here. But um, I thought I would kind of hit two birds with, with one stone here. As you can tell, I've already done my makeup and then I wanted to do something really fun, hopefully, with you guys today. So I just bought a new hair tool. And I got it because my director of operations, Eden, swears by this thing. She bought it on Amazon, it is very inexpensive, and she said it totally changed her life and her hair routine in the morning. So, let me show it to you. <laughs> I have not opened the box, so this is gonna be a tried and true first time ever using it. It is called the One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. Smooth, frizz-free blowouts in half the time. So the idea is that it is a hair dryer and a brush in one. So let's look at it. This is gonna be a fun little practice. Okay, so this is how it comes. Oh, it's pink and black. Okay. So it is this one piece. Oh, it comes with two hair clips. This is what it looks like, ladies and gents. So it looks like it has a high, middle, low, and off version. The bristles on the brush are kind of like, um, looks like they have both sort of that natural texture and the plastic. And then it has a long cord. Um, let me open up. I was gonna use my own like uh, little hair clips, but maybe I'll use theirs just so we can get the full experience. Okay, so my hair is damp, it's been towel dried. I put a little product in it, which we'll link, to, I'll, we'll link in the blog post. So let's see, okay. So I'm gonna separate my hair out into a couple sections right now. And I'm gonna plug this bad, bad girl in. Let's hope she works. But look, I just wanna kinda show you in relation to my head. So it's big, so. Clearly it's better, if, it's not good if you want like little tiny curls, but it's good if you want sort of a smooth blowout. Okay, so I just plugged her in. Let me section off my hair and I'm gonna get started. I just flung one of the hair things in the toilet. I'll get that later. Actually, let me get that now so I don't forget. No, I'm gonna get that later, yeah, okay. All right, so here we go. <laughs> All right, here goes nothing, or maybe here goes everything. Maybe this is the new amazing thing of my life. Okay. <laughs> I'm scared, kind of. All right. <laughs> so here I'm taking the section of hair. And I guess I'm gonna put it on high. Okay, so let me just tell you what I'm learning so far. So obviously it's taking me a second to figure out how to use it. But this piece of hair is dry, and I'll do the whole head so you can kind of see, but it's like very smooth, I would say. Um, and there's not too much bend to it, but there's a little bit. Um, and I'm definitely noticing it definitely takes, I can't figure out yet if it's better to use it where you kind of slowly go down the hair or if you do it a few times, but I'm gonna do this side and then the other side and we'll look at the lower level of hair. Stay tuned. Okay. So that time I put it on low while it, I was curling to see if it would add a bit of curl. Let's see, kind of did. I mean, that's amazing. Like my hair is dry in two seconds. It also is making my hair look really long, which I love. Like, look at, let me just 
to my bra strap so you can really see. Right? It's pretty. Okay, let me do the other side. Guys, is this gonna change all of our lives? This is like the equivalent of like the Amazon jacket, you know, that all the moms on the Upper East Side were wearing. Maybe this cheap or inexpensive, I should say, tool is gonna change our lives. Okay, let's try again. Let's do more. We'll see how it is on the top but like to use a round brush and a hair dryer for me because I have a lot of hair to blow dry like up here it was like an arm workout on my arms it just was so exhausting I would have to kind of stop in the middle sometimes um, and Eden who recommended this brush to me was saying the same thing because she is like crazy beautiful amazing thick hair kind of like Marlo hair <laughs> Um, so, okay, let me just do the top now. Let's see. Oh, first, oh, hang on, sorry. You can really tell like the natural wave of my hair. It's not curly at all per se, but there's definitely a natural wave in there. So it's doing a good job at, you know, smoothing that. Okay, so I have one piece. Okay, so, so far, and obviously I'm stopping and starting to explain things, I've only been doing this video for 14 minutes. So normally it takes me about 35 minutes to blow out my hair, right? So I think if I were doing this not in a tutorial, it would probably be taking me, I don't know, 10 minutes so far to do like, now at this point, like half of my head is done. So maybe this is gonna cut my time down by like 15 minutes, let's see. So I figured out low, so medium is a lower um, speed of the regular 
heat. High is the higher speed of regular heat, but low, when you put it to low, it's actually a higher speed of a low heat setting to set the hair, I'm assuming. So that's what I figured out so far. But like, look how shiny. Look at that. You guys. So, I mean, that is a pretty stellar blowout. <laughs> All right. Okay, let me do the other side and then I will show you guys the final product. And we'll speed through this because who wants to see me do my whole thing here? Okay, last piece. Last piece and then we're gonna really see what's up. Here's my lip gloss. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm super into it. There's my hair, I love. You can see what it did. Do -do. You can see up close, there's super nice lift. I'm into it. I'm gonna call this babe hair. If you want babe hair, <laughs> I'm putting all the links to this thing. Here, obviously, but here it is. I love you. I'll be using this a lot. Bye.